up with the inning. Leads to second and goal at the eight yard line. Now it looks like he'll throw here. This will be caught at about the six. Now the Packers going to burn their third and final timeout. It'll be their third and final timeout, so as they talk things over, we'll step aside. Now Foles. To the goal line, but it's incomplete. From the snap, he certainly looked like... elsewhere to no avail. I guess not content to get another three here late. They'll try to add six more as they go and give them another six. It's good for the touchdown. And the ball continues. Well, business as usual for them. Well on their way to another victory. Riding a serious wave of momentum from what we've seen. And so far, they haven't met their match. So if you're going to play this team in the future, your mission is clear. You better be ready to play and match their firepower. Two able to connect on the extra point. And the lead will swell by one more. The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. That'll be taken about a yard deep. And tackled at the 21-yard line, so a net negative there of four yards. Here are the Vikings now to start their next drive. Let's just be frank. They're playing for pride at this point. <laughs> that's, that's all that's left because victory, not a chance now. And I can't wait to see how they actually go about doing it because there are a lot of people watching the body language of the guys on the field now, and if they call plays they want executed, they need to do that and do it really well. Otherwise, there could be repercussions. We'll see how they handle the waning moments of this one. And it's incomplete. So now only seven seconds remain. An incomplete pass on second down leads us to third and inches. Looking to throw. Prescott. And he's got a man. It's the tight end Howard complete. And he goes out right around the 39. It'll be a gain of eight yards, and it'll move the chains. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. One last shot now for Prescott. And a double coverage, and it's intercepted. Picked up by Kareem Jackson. And he will be out of bounds here with zeros on the clock as this ball game is over. Today, Charles, it's one thing to win. It's another thing to win and put up the amount of points that they did. Why were they clicking on offense? They can't help but feel great about themselves, can they? I mean, what a game to put up that number of points, continually feel like they're moving the ball and things are working and clicking. They think that they can bottle this and carry it with them. And as an offensive coordinator, you just don't think you can do anything wrong. With